All right, we are back on Get Up, and again, to take you back to the scene yesterday in Wisconsin, this moment between Jawan Howard, the coach of Michigan, uh, and that's Greg Gard, the head coach of Wisconsin, after Gard had called the timeout very late in a game that Wisconsin had already easily won, and, and then again, this moment here, you'll see Jawan Howard with an open hand, I don't know what you want to call it, a slap or whatever, to an assistant coach, Joe Krabenhoft, and then mm -hmm. all that came after. We talked about it at length earlier today, and I, I'm, I'm so glad that Jay Will is able to make it across the hall. KJ every morning on ESPN radio but a few minutes for us here just right off the top of your head we all saw it yesterday mm -hmm. college basketball is something that is so near and dear to your heart yes what's your reaction uh, Greg Gard should be suspended for one game and I think that Jawan Howard should be suspended for the rest of the season uh, including the regular season and post uh, tournament play it, here's the thing there's culpability on a variety of issues here Greeny number one uh, I get why Juwan Howard was angry. Uh, pretty much the unwritten rules of basketball. If you're up double digits with 14 or 15 seconds left to go in the game, regardless if the, if the other team is pressing or not, you don't call a timeout. Uh, you're doing that, that's an insult. Juwan Howard was actually trying to give him a blow by. Was gonna give him a dead fish, handshake, move on quickly. Greg Gard actually grabbed his left arm, mm -hmm. grabbed him. And you heard Juwan Howard say, don't grab me, do not touch me. Uh, I don't think Greg Gard should ever feel the entitlement to grab another coach to begin with, even if he wanted to explain himself. That's number one. Number two for Juwan Howard in this moment, this is a guy, and I've known Juwan Howard for a long part of my life. Last year, he had a situation with Mark Turgeon where he was caught charging after Mark Turgeon. It looked chaotic. Mark Turgeon reported, the head coach of Maryland, that he said, I would blanking kill you. Right? Uh, now to be in a situation where it looks like he was moving away from the contact, then throw a punch, even if it was open hand, that opens up Pandora's box screening for the rest of your team to start fighting into a physical altercation. And I think when something like that happens, considering the prior history, you have to suspend him for the rest of the season. Uh, it, it's such a, a, a bad set of circumstances in so many different ways. To your point, if Greg Gard wants to explain to him, I'm not in any way excusing what Juwan Howard did. Where are you? Over here. Uh, I'm not in any way excusing what uh, what, what Juwan Howard did. Yes. But if Greg Gard wants to explain to him why he did it, he can do it later. He, yes. he can call him on the phone. 1, it's not like these people have no ability to communicate with each other any other time than this the, the, the handshake line. Very quickly, because I had Seth and Jay Billis in here earlier talking about the handshake line in general. I mean, is that where, where do you stand on the whole handshake line of it all? I mean, I, I'm whatever on it, to be honest with you. If that's what people want to do, the show, hey, you know, good chivalry. Like, you know, we played the game well, right. fine. But, I mean, that, that whole thing didn't even need to occur because Greg Gard did not need to grab him. That does not excuse Juwan Howard and his reaction. You know, most of the time in these situations, the person who reacts is the one that gets caught. Right. But, look, you don't throw hands at anybody. If you, if you do that as a representation of the forward face of the University of Michigan, there has to be major repercussions for Ward Manuel to have imposed on Juwan Howard because yeah. of that. It, it escalates the situation. To yeah, your and point. I don't yes. think he should lose his job. Right. I think he should be suspended for the rest of the season. Right. Yeah, like they, they shouldn't have been pressing, and then they shouldn't have called a timeout, and then this, but none of it excuses this yes, is agreed. the point. I, I think that's, that's the most important point to be made here. All right. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN Plus right now.